Sampling of attributed networks from hierarchical generative models. This is a joint work of Pablo Robles, Sebastián Moreno, and Jennifer Neville. Network sampling is the process of using a generative network model to randomly create a network. Network sampling is a powerful tool that facilitates tasks such as hypothesis testing and sensitivity analysis. However, sampling of networks with correlated vertex attributes remains a challenging problem. Correlated vertex attributes are due to the attributes in the nodes, for example, political views, gender, or whether a person is a client or not, are attributes, and their correlation is an important feature in the network. Real networks are large and have varying and complex characteristics. In consequence, newer generative models have been proposed to represent real networks. To do so, they use a hierarchy of random variables which concentrates the probability mass to smaller regions of the space to reflect the dependencies among edges in the network. This produces realistic network characteristics, but also makes sampling more difficult, especially when trying to sample graphs with correlated vertex attributes. In order to sample, we're exploring a network model, but we have to combine it with attributes. More precisely, given a network data, we can fit a distribution to the attributes and a generative model to the structure. These are marginals corresponding to the distribution of graphs here represented in the horizontal axis and the distribution of attributes in the vertical axis. Our task is to perform sampling from this joint distribution. However, due to the complex shape of the distribution, if sampling starts from a region with low likelihood, the search can lead to a particular mode from which it may not be easy to escape due to local minima. This difficulty is exacerbated due to the problem of concentration of mass in the hierarchical models that I described before. To solve this problem, we condition on the attributes, and given the attribute value, we sample the structure. We propose CISAC, constraint sampling for attributed networks, that introduces two stages of sampling that via the search to regions of the network space with higher likelihood. It replaces the original basic sampling of the hierarchical generative model with a first stage that samples edges, and if the target correlation is not feasible on the sample edges, it uses a second stage to sample blocks of edges. If needed, this stage is executed until the root of hierarchy is reached. We test the CSAC using three datasets, shown here in different colors, and compared with two implementations of a competing alternative, which is the state of the art in these datasets. Our method CSAC is represented with crosses. The figure shows the combined error for attributes and structure, the attributes errors in the y-axis and the structural errors in the x-axis, for which we consider the clustering coefficient, degree, and hop plot distributions. The best performers are to the bottom left, closer to the origin. As shown in the figure, CSAC is the best performer with the lowest combined error for all three datasets. Our paper contains a discussion of problems in hierarchical generative models and includes the details of the CSAC sampling to solve these problems. We provide detailed evidence of CSAC's benefits with three real-world datasets.